Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, and I have started the Adventures of Sherlock Holmes, which is a collection of 12 short stories by Arthur Conan Doyle, get starring, you guessed it, Sherlock Holmes. If you want to see my videos on the first two main novels, studying Scarlet and the Sign of Four, then the link is at the top of the screen. So overall, I found this to be a uh, very enjoyable sort story, the, that being a, a scandal in Bohemia. It has Irene Adler in it, who I knew from the TV show with Benedict Cumberbatch. And I don't know if like this is the only story she's in or if she's going to show up again, but either way, she's a very interesting character here. I like how unlike the TV show with Benedict, in the original, this is not exactly a romantic partner for Sherlock. He's, he's more of just kind of a foil for him. Which I actually prefer because, you know, uh, Watson remarks in this short story that he's never really, like, into women. He's just more focused on his job. The story also has um, Sorlock go undercover, which I don't think he's done in the past two books. And he's able to, like, sneak in the Irene Adler's secret wedding. And, like, there's a secret pixel or portrait of her, which is very revealing. And it's of her and the king, who she used to be married to. And the king, like, is paying Sorlock to um, get the pixel from her. And this is the first time Sherlock Holmes doesn't succeed because she outsmarts him by switching the pixels and making him think like it was burned in a file. So she runs away with her new husband and to tell Sherlock, you know, you almost got me. <laughs> and, and she just kind of escapes and goes away. Now, I don't you know, I like Irene Adler as a character because she's not exactly an antagonist. You know, it's not like she killed anybody. Um, she's, I don't know. It's not like she's like evil or anything. She just ran away with her husband, kind of. And she's like, you know what? I'm not going to do this scandal anymore. Who cares? And that's kind of the end of it. But Sherlock, you know, he asks to keep a picture of her because he's just impressed with how she outsmarted him. And I like that, because these past two novels, Sherlock was five steps ahead of everybody else. But in this, she's actually ahead of him. So, all in all, I thought this was a very enjoyable story. Um, much more digestible than the past two. I mean, not that, you know, I like the past two a lot, but this one only took me one day to read. The other ones took me five days. Obviously, this is a sold story. It was only, like, 25 pages or whatever. So, yeah, let me know down in the comments what you guys thought of A Scandal in Bohemia. Let me know down in the comments below. Um, I think I'm gonna take a little bit break before I do the next short story, The Red-Headed League, and that's just because I have so much videos to make on my calendar. So I'm just gonna, you know, record these in succession, then release them on random days, you know, when I don't have a video premiering that day. So my next, um, Sherlock video, The Red-Headed League, will be in two weeks from now, on the 21st. So subscribe if you want to see that. And in the meantime, like I said, I make a lot of videos every day, so subscribe if you want to see videos on The Hobbit, Better Call Saul, This Is Us, Doctor Who, uh, The Sailor Jane Adventures, Everything Everywhere All at Once, and uh, until then, peace.